Hi guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show to make this motion source animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So after doing this project, I will share this template you can download. So first step, let's create a new background. Right mouse, new and solid. Add name background, click OK. Then go to FX presets, search effect fill. And let's use fill this solid. Open color and change white. Click OK and lock layer. Then go to shape layers and select ellipse tool and change color this pink click ok and hold shift make circle then click selection tool and change width 19 ok and change name circle and select the circle hold control click this icon for move anchor point center click selection tool and go to add open trim path open here change end zero and make end keyframe and let's click here let's add plus 10 for go to 10 keyframe let's click enter okay we can see here 10 keyframes and let's change end 100 select keyframes make easy let's see okay let's go to here and we can see here this circle not smooth let's open ellipse one stroke one and change butt cap to round cap okay we can see this is smooth let's close this circle settings and select this circle go to a link click this icon and this for move to center this object and press u select only k frames hold shift press p go to first second make new position k frame and move to down go to 10 k frame for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down in the keyboard let's move to up again go to 10 k frame move to down again 10 k frame move to up again 10 k frame move to down let's see okay select these keyframes make easy and let's see nice so select these end keyframes move to here let's see okay select this first end keyframe move to left nice select these last four keyframes hold alt move to left Okay, select this end, move to right. Nice. Okay, so go to here and select this circle. Let's open settings. Go to trim paths and make start keyframe. Go to here and change 100. Let's see. Okay. Select these start keyframes, make easy. And let's select these first end keyframes. Go to graph editor, make smooth graph. Let's see. Okay. Select these start keyframes, go to graph editor, make smooth graph. Okay, move to right. And in this time, go to here. Select this circle again. Press U for see only J frames. Make new position J frame, and go to here. Move to down, and go to here. Move to up. Let's move to here this J frame. Let's see. Okay. Select these three J frames. Move to left, and this move to left. okay so in this time go to pen tool and hold shift make one here and one here for line shape click selection tool 
and change name line open settings contents shape one and stroke one change again round cup okay and select this line go to add select trim paths and open this trim path let's change int zero and go to first second make end k frame and go to 10k frame change 100 select k frames make easy and close settings press u for c k frames and move to right let's see okay let's move to right again nice okay select k frames go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph okay nice so select this line go to pen tool and let's select this point hold shift move to up for change size okay nice let's go to here and select this line let's move to right okay nice let's see nice so in this time select this line hold shift press p and make new position k frame go to here and move to right select k frames make easy go to graph editor select this graph make smooth and uh, let's see okay back to k frames Select this chain frame, move to right. Select chain frames, move to left. Nice. So, in this time, let's go to text and write hello. Click selection tool and go to color select this blue click ok let's change hello friends click selection tool okay select this line last position key frame and move to right let's see okay so select this line and hold shift press s in this time make scale key frame go to here and change scale like this and let's move to up let's see select this scale key frames make easy go to graph editor make smooth graph nice click this icon back to chair frames so in this time select this text and go to shape select this Rachel tool and let's make part like this okay and open mask one select this mask pad and click selection tool go to here and in this time select this path move to right and make mask path k frame go to frame by frame one frame move to right this path next frame again move to right okay let's move to right again this is last s
Okay, done. Click selection tool. And let's see. Nice. So this is closed our text. And we need to open this text with this shape. Let's click invert it. And let's say again. Okay, nice. Select this text. Let's close settings and move to back this line. Let's see. So in this time, let's select this text and cut here. Let's see. Okay, let's cut again. Okay, let's see again. Nice. So select these all layers. Click toggle switch modes and click motion blur and click this icon. So thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.